What's up guys, Nolan here, and today we're going over the current fleet from my org known as the Nice Guys Private Military Corporation, which not including small or starter ships, comes in at over $127,675, aka $130,000 worth of ships. Apart from the obvious, we chose the name Nice Guys because we are going to be a good guy reputation org. We feel it'll give us the widest range of gameplay options compared to general bad guys or space pirates gameplay since there will be plenty of people running that way. So when it comes to PvP, we're confident we won't get bored hunting one wanted players or groups of players then when we are looking for some place to stay rearm or refuel it should be easier to find friendly faces we also don't want the military breathing down our necks we'd rather work with them with the ships we currently own there is nothing that we can't do in game in terms of industry and we won't need to find anyone to help protect it because we have plenty of pew to go around for all intents and purposes we will be able to mine explore salvage run cargo run data and construct whatever we want whenever we want from day one albeit just not as efficiently since we will have stock ships so we will need to upgrade them over time. The end goal really is freedom to choose how to play the game the way we want without any issues. The initial numbers consist of a community that I've built from the game Escape from Tarkov, which by the way, if you're interested, the link for my Tarkov channel is in the description. And because it was a pretty sizable community, we've started strong with 400 plus ships. And thanks to a few avid Star Citizen fans in the group, we also have, as of right now, one Javelin, three Krakens, four Idrises, two Hull E's, four Orions, 19 Merchantmen, five Endeavors, and two Pioneers at the top of our fleet. I'm naming these specifically because because they're the ones that need the most crew and we need people. So if you think you'll make a good fit, then click the link at the top of the description and apply today. We could really use the help. Just a heads up, you must be a member of the Discord to join, link is below. So that Javelin will likely be joined by at least three or four more in the next couple of years, but we'll see what happens. We currently own this one for the purpose of killing capital ships, of course, but as well as intimidation because it's a Javelin. The Hull E's will of course run cargo, the Orions will mine, the Merchantmen will extend trade routes and money to the org. The Endeavors can be a lot of things, but likely will be our outer hubs for the org and spawn locations. The pioneers will be used to construct bases and we will have the ability to be hired to do the same for others with security included. The Krakens will be used as ferries for quick reaction forces and security, but we may use them for high value cargo running as well. The Idrises are of course purely combat, but we will see what else we can do with them. Our total combat oriented fleet as of the recording of this video is that one Javelin, three Krakens, four Idrises, as a meme, because we have so many, we might flock the merchantmen with their size 8 guns and hangar, but we'll see if it's capable of that once it's in game. And we have 19 of those, 8 Polarises, 1 Nautilus, 5 Liberators, 8 Hammerheads, 13 Perseuses, 5 A2s, 3 Retaliators, this one's debatable for combat, but we have 11 Constellations, 9 Redeemers, 3 Valkyries, 15 plus Vanguards, 12 Cuddy Blacks, 3 Prowlers, 18 Ares Starfighters, mostly Infernos, 3 Lightnings, 15 plus Hornets, but mostly Super Hornets, 15 plus Scorpiuses, 15 plus Sabres, several Santok Yais and Defenders, several Arrows, 15 plus Hurricanes, 15 plus Gladiuses, several Freelancers of all types, 8 Eclipses, 8 Nova Tanks, as well as a ton of other smaller ships, starter ships, and ground vehicles. We stopped counting those as well as the ships that I called out as 15 plus because there's just too much to keep track of. Our industrial slash money making slash renting fleet is two hull E's, four Orions, those 19 merchantmen, five hull D's, three 890 jumps, five endeavors, two pioneers, three reclaimers, four odysseys, nine carracks, three hull C's, two caterpillars, four starfarers, four M2s, three C2s, A600i, three Crucibles, two Genesis Starliners, five 400Is, 11 Star Runners, two Corsairs, three Raylans, a Hull B, five Moles, three Medivacs, four Rafts, two Vulcans, some Cuddy Reds and Blues, a few Vultures, a few Prospectors, six Terrapins, a bunch of 300 series and a ton of starter ships like Avengers, Auroras, Mustangs, and Reliance. Again, towards the end there, and with the smaller ships, we just lost count. Generally speaking, with those smaller ships, whether they're industrial or combat, there's just a lot of people in the org that either have them or they use them to then upgrade later, so there's just too much movement to keep track of. So the numbers do get fuzzy, and I probably missed several things, but it's a lot, so give me a break. The cool stuff is definitely mentioned. Just know that if you end up making some friends in the org, you will have no shortage of access to ships, I guarantee you. And while we're on that subject, 
you won't necessarily have access to all of the biggest and best stuff. We will have a ranking system in place to build trust in our members, which you can learn more about by joining the Discord link below and choosing the Star Citizen role or clicking the link in the description to just join the org. I'll have more videos discussing tactics, formations, tutorials, and just everything Star Citizen, but that's for later. If you want to check out my personal fleet, you can check the link in the description or at the end of the video. But for now, for more Star Citizen content, check out these playlists here. If you like this video, then you know the drill. Please subscribe. I really appreciate the people who do. If you're looking for people to play with, check out our Discord. Links in the description if you're interested. Otherwise, I hope you have a nice day in the verse. See you guys.